Hey guys, it's Chloe here. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So today guys, I am doing the first reading comments video of 2021 and I am so excited to dive into these comments and I cannot wait. So yeah, let's do this. Right guys, so I've got my computer down here. So if you see me glancing down here, that's what I'm reading off. <laughs> so the first comment comes from Vera Maria. Their comment is, Greetings from Finland. I'm a shellite collector and I just ordered my white lions. They are absolutely beautiful. I cannot agree more. I have the shellite lioness mother and cubs. If you guys are new to the channel and haven't watched it, there's a video link up there. You can go and check that video out. But yeah, they are these those figures I've got are really beautiful and I want to expand my white lion collection if I can. So I'm looking for more white lions to add to that pride and kind of build up another pride. Because I have my Lion King Shalike collection, but I also want to build up a white lion pride collection. I cannot wait to grow that collection. Hopefully I can grow it some more during this year, maybe next year as well. And we'll have two prides. <laughs> I'll have two prides in my collection. So yeah, thank you so much Vera for your comment. I'm so pleased to hear that my videos have made it all the way to Finland. <laughs> People in Finland are reviewing them. That is incredible. So thank you guys so much for that comment. And let's read the next one. Right guys, so the next comment comes from Sonia Suri. Their comment was, I love lions and wolves. Do more shalike and lion wolf videos. I have plenty more shalike videos in the works. I will probably do another collection update on my Lion King Shalike collection sometime in the year. I'm not sure when yet, but I've got other collection updates that I want to do update videos on. I already did my wolf pack collection, um, but there are plenty of other collections. There's my horse collection, my Shalike horse collection, there's my Shalike Lion Pride collection, there's the White Lioness pr Lion Pride that I'm starting. So yeah, we've got plenty more Shalike videos coming in 2021 and for hopefully many years to come yet. So thank you so much Sonia for that comment, I really do appreciate it. Right guys, so the next comment comes from Blaze Haste. They said, well, I haven't watched you in ages. Sorry, that's absolutely fine. <laughs> I don't mind if you watch every single one of my videos or you just watch a couple of my videos or you watch a particular series of my videos. The fact that you come back to the channel, that, that's enough for me. I really do appreciate that. <laughs> um, don't do it again. Don't, don't, don't leave again. You know, just, just stay. <laughs> I love, I love those types of comments because they're like, sorry, I haven't watched your, I haven't watched this video in ages or I haven't watched these videos in ages. It's like, it's fine. <laughs> they're here for when you want them. <laughs> That is the beauty of the internet. I upload this and it's up there forever. So even if you don't watch it, as soon as it comes out, it'll still be there going, hello, please watch me, please watch me. The next comment comes from Animal2002 Lover. And they said, I'm glad you're doing reviews on these creatures because I'm always curious to hear your thoughts on the figures. I really do appreciate that, guys. If you like my reviews on the certain shalike figures or you want me to review a certain shalike figure, all you gotta do is leave it down below in the comments saying, you know, I really would love to do... At the minute, I'm doing the Eldrador shalike series where I'm reviewing all the Eldrador figures and I've got a few of those lined up in a, the next couple of weeks, figures I want to do a review on. Um, but yeah, if there's any other figures you want me to look at like shalike figures or papo figures or whatever that you want me to do a review on please let me know down below in the comments because i'm happy to expand my review series from eldrador to other shalike figures so like shalike horses shalike wolves shalike lions or even papo wolves papo lions whatever if there is a figure out there that you want me to review just let me know down below in the comments and i'll be sure to check it out and i'd be happy to share my thoughts on it and add it to my collection which just continues to grow. It grows and grows and grows. At this point, I need a bigger cupboard. I have that little cupboard up there with the pure Chloe on. That's where all my figures go. And I'm running out of space. So I'm gonna need a bigger cupboard. <laughs> Right guys, so the next comment is kind of two comments that I've rolled into one because they were literally like, they came straight after each other but they're from the same person so I thought I'd roll their two comments into one big comment and share it with you guys. Comes from, it's Chloe the Meme YT. Interesting channel name. The first comment was, I can't find any of those online and that refers to the Shalike blind bags. Uh, I'm not sure how old the Shalike blind bags are. I don't know whether they were like something new that Shalike are doing or 
what or whether they were just selling them in certain shops. I just happened to stumble upon the blind bag when I was going to view Shalike figures in Smith's Toy Superstore and they had a couple on sale there and I thought mm, pick one of those up so you know I just keep looking. I check the I check places like eBay. I'd even look on the Shalike actual website maybe they do them on there. I'm not 100% sure but yeah it just happened by chance that I stumbled upon those figures uh, well the blind bag so I thought mm, that'd make a cool video idea so I got one so yeah i just keep your eyes peeled you, you should find some eventually there's got to be some around somewhere their next comment was i'm also called chloe yes chloe is a very awesome name i'm gonna say that and that's not just because it is my name but yeah i kind of like the name chloe originally i was not going to be called chloe originally my parents were going to call me samantha i don't know how they came to the name chloe because my parents thought i was a boy when my mom was pregnant with me interesting story they were so convinced i was a boy that they were going to call me sam which is my brother's name and when i came out as a girl they were a bit like eh what do we do now so at first they were like mm, we'll call her samantha and then they were like mm, but I also, they also like looked in like all the name books and they liked the name Louise and they liked the name Chloe so my full name is Chloe Samantha Louise Bruff so they put all the names together they couldn't pick between those three names so they're just like you know what let's just squish them all together and then um six years later my mom got pregnant again and Sam came into the world <laughs> and this time he was a boy <laughs> So they were like, we'll call that one Sam. But yeah, I was originally meant to be called Sam. Then I was going to be called Samantha. And I was going to be called Louise. And then my mom found the name Chloe. And she was like, you know what? I like the name Chloe more than the other two. So she made the other two names my middle names. And the Chloe my first name. There's the story behind my name. <laughs> It's a long, confusing and weird one. It is such a long name and thank you mum for picking such long middle names, you know? When you're writing on a form, please write your middle names. Samantha, Louise. <laughs> that is the story behind my name. I, I, I don't know how I rambled on to that. But yeah, Chloe is a pretty awesome name. I'm gonna I'm gonna say that. Chloe's a pretty awesome name. If you call Chloe, welcome to the group. Um if you're not called Chloe, don't worry, we'll include you in our group. You can be fellow Chloe's, you can be honorary Chloe members. Well we'll allow you. Uh, well I will anyway. I don't know if other Chloe's will. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling and move on to the next documento. The next comment comes from Gabriel Rogers. Their comment was great video. I just brought a series three online for a good deal. I'm not actually wearing my watch today, which is kind of weird uh, but yeah I have the series 3 Apple watch as well and I've been getting on really well with mine and um, it's actually been I've actually been using it to track my weight and I have actually been losing weight which is kind of cool I've actually used it to track my steps so on a work day uh, obviously I'll do more steps because I've got to walk to and from work and I'm also because I'm working in a shop I have to walk around the shop and you know do certain things do certain jobs I can I can definitely tell that my pet shop job I'm definitely more active because I have when I have certain days off from the pet shop I find because I'm just sat in front of my computer I'm not moving as much so my watch kind of prompts me it's kind of like yo stand up stand up walk around for five minutes <laughs> kind of tells me it's like wait come on come on lazy get on up there <laughs> <laughs> but yeah I, I like the series I like the series 3 watch um, I don't think I'd want a bigger watch personally because I have very thin wrists anyway so for me the series 3 and plus it was 200 quid the series 3 it just seemed like the best option for myself at the time I didn't really want to spend like 500 600 pound on a watch I thought it would benefit me in the long run because when I am at work um, obviously I'm on the shop floor I'm working you're not allowed your phone on you however if someone does need to get a hold of me my watch is still connected to my phone so if someone rings my phone it comes from my watch and i'm like hello what do you want kind of look like a secret agent i'm kind of like yes i'll get those documents i kind of feel like a secret agent when i wear my watch i think it's just my inner child coming out or i just want to be a secret agent i'll let you decide all right guys so the final comment in this reading comments video comes from crispy animations and their comment is great video straightforward to the point Getting mine on Friday or Sunday. Excited smiley face. Yeah, uh, I try, when I do like anything, like my reviews on, if I'm reviewing tech or if I'm unboxing tech, I try and keep it as basic as I can, not just because I am basic when it comes to tech 
to technology anyway you know it takes me a while to get my head around certain things honestly i just like I just don't like the ones that go into like when I watch when I watch tech reviews I don't I don't understand when they go into like the specs of things and stuff like that that's kind of like a different language to me whereas I like watching the more simpler unboxings where they're just like so this is the iPhone we are as you can see it has a camera on the front uh, but when they start going, oh, it has a, a 1080p, da 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 da, da I'm kind of like, okay, I'm lost. <laughs> so yeah, when I do my reviews on anything, I try and keep it, not basic, but I try and keep it as simple and as easily understandable as I can. Because I know that there are people out there like me that are not so tech savvy. There are people out there that are like, they want to hear the specs of things and they want to hear how certain things and the components in it work that's fine but sometimes I just want to hear like someone's thought that's not so tech savvy and just hear what they think about it so I'm really happy to hear that people like that my Apple Watch review like you know the unboxing and what I think about it I'll definitely probably do more of those in the future when I do get more tech maybe perhaps when I do get uh, myself a better camera you know and perhaps I'll do a camera review and a camera unboxing on that let me know guys down below if you actually want to see that because if you do that'll be great and yeah thank you so much to crispy animations for that fabulous comment i really do appreciate it so guys that concludes the first reading comments episode of 2021 i hope you guys have enjoyed if you guys have please leave a massive uh, thumbs up leave some beautiful comments down below i absolutely love reading your guys comments even if it's just something like enjoyed the video or thank you for this or you know just sharing your thoughts on a particular thing i just like reading people's comments and trying to respond to them sometimes i don't like reply to every single one but i will like try and love heart as many of them as i can just so like people know that hello i'm there <laughs> your comment is being taken seriously um i am going to try in 2021 to try and respond to every single comment i can uh, as of this video so if you do comment on any of my videos in the future you will most likely definitely get a reply from me because i'm making it my mission to make sure that i reply to every single person that takes the time to leave a nice comment on my videos because why not you know what i mean you've taken the time to leave that comment i should take the time to respond to it i know some creators with like massive followings can't do that but because my following is so small at the minute i am going to make more of an effort to make sure that those who are supporting me you know can have that i don't want to say bond but like they have that they feel as if that i'm listening to them because i wouldn't i'd hate to feel that someone's watching my channel and they've commented on a video and i just haven't responded and they they think oh she just doesn't care i do care um but yeah definitely with 2021 i'm gonna try and respond to every single one of my videos and after this video <laughs> i'm gonna do some editing and then i will be in the comments section so yeah please be sure to leave those fabulous comments down below and finally 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 if you are new to the channel and you haven't yet already please oh please hit that beautiful subscribe button as i am filming this we're at 771 beautiful and fabulous subscribers so thank you guys so much for that thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see all you beautiful people friday at five for another video. Uh, bye bye. Bye.